Hey guys, CJ here. Today we have the Holy Stone HS430 mini drone. So I just want to do a quick, quick unboxing and a little demonstration and kind of go over some of the features that this one has. So let's go ahead and start. So it does come with your instructions. It does come nicely packaged. It is this kind of like a matte gray color finish to it, which is super cool. I like that. I dig that. The propellers are like a translucent gray, which is this is right up my alley. So it does come with three batteries. If you charge all three of them, you'll get up to 39 to 40 minutes of runtime. So you can go for a little bit of time and just fully enjoy this mini drone, which is really, really convenient. It does fold up to very small. It's like the size of a mouse, kind of fits in my palm and my hand. All the wings kind of branch out here and then they lock into place. They kind of snap into place. And then this one does have a 1080p full HD camera on the front. So you can hook it up to your phone, which I can show you um, and do like a VR mode, uh, which is legit. It does 360 flips. You can do gravity control, voice control. You can start it on the ground. You can throw it in the air and it'll take off. It'll do like a circle flight. So if you're standing somewhere, um, you can hit that and it'll start going in a circle and just record everything. Um, so there's a lot of cool features uh, into this drone itself, which is very nice. I'm, I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. Um, and it's just super small and compact, so you can kind of take it on the go for trips. So this is great for, uh, you know, kids that are able to fly drones. Um, that's right up their alley. I do want to mention it does come with spare propellers. So if one does break, don't worry, you can fix it. Um, and then you can also place on these propeller guards. So if it does hit something, it can it'll bounce off these before it will hit this, and that will um, protect your uh, propeller. So you just slide those in to these little slots on the outside right there, um, and then they'll protect them because they're a little bit wider than the actual propeller itself. So there's that as well. So it does come with a charger, and it does just pop right onto the bottom of these batteries right here, and it'll charge it up, and then you'll get your runtime. So I recommend just charging them all prior to using just so you can get the full maximum experience of it. The remote here, so you can place your phone right here. It will adjust and clamp down to your phone. So I have an iPhone 13 Pro Max. Um, it does hold that so you can see that this will hold pretty much any phone, which is great. So close up of the remote, you have a take a picture and if you long press, that will start your video recording. So right here you have headless mode and then trimmer. If you long press it, this is your um, auto start and landing. So if you just hold that, it'll um, start your ascent and then it'll also just automatically land where it is right there right in here is low and high so that's your speed if you want low speed or if you want high speed you can crank it all the way over there and then you have your high speed rotation if you click it so it'll do like a flip um, and then you also if you long press it it'll do the circle fly which i mentioned it'll just start doing a circle and kind of like if you turn on the video recording it'll just kind of film what you're doing which is pretty cool so then on your joysticks you have up down which will ascend descend you go rotate to your left rotate to your right and then you have up is go forward this is go backwards left is fly to your left and then this flies to your right and then this will also help you do the 360 flip i would also recommend downloading this app this is what you're going to be able to use and pair to your uh, drone so you can see it and use it while it is mounted in your controller all right, so I want to show you how to pair this up close before we go outside, just because I think it's super important that you see this up close. So you want the tail always facing you, and then the camera is the head, so that'll face away. To turn it on, you hold down this power button. The lights will start flashing. That's, that's okay. Then you go to your remote. You will hold down the power button, and it makes a DD sound, so they're flashing. And then you're going to go up and down. The lights will stop blinking that means it's paired to the controller now to calibrate it you're going to need to take both joysticks and you're going to go to the right slant it this way the lights will flash and then it'll do another d now it is calibrated between the remote so it's paired and now calibrated so now it is fully ready to go they, they recommend calibrating it every time it crashes just so it can kind of redo its thing and be aligned and then right before you take flight, you're going to want to unlock the motor. So you're actually going to take both joysticks and go in towards the power button at an angle. That will start it. So now it is fully ready to go. You can either hold it in your hand and throw it up or you hit this button and it will take off straight up. And that is how you pair and calibrate the program. So now it is fully good to go. 
Um, like I said, you bring them both down here, you'll start it, and then you can fly it. So then you wanna connect to the Holystone Wi-Fi. All right, so after you connect the to the Wi-Fi, it takes a few seconds, and then you go into the app and you hit enter device, which is right here. You hit enter device, and it'll pull up. So it is literally looking at my wall right now. That's kind of where it's at. Um, that's how you use it. So this is will go right in here, and then you'll be able to fully function and use this however you want it you can take pictures you can take the video um you can do all sorts of different uh connections with it so literally i could just take a photo and then now it is recording so whatever i do with this drone it will actually just record straight to my phone and it'll save it um, i'll show you outside as well so i can actually get some footage of the drone flying around um, and share that with you guys as well. All right, so now that it's all set up, let's go outside and fly this thing around and get a feel for it. I'm very new at flying drones, um, but I'm very excited to go do this. So let's go check that out. So overall, I'm really impressed with the quality of this drone. I do like the light gray, kind of matte finish to it. The camera is really, really nice. It's convenient where you can see where you can fly, but also you can take pictures and record things. I am absolutely terrible at flying this thing, so I didn't record myself flying the actual drone. Um, it'd be too difficult to pick it up on camera, but I am showing you from what it looks like from the drone perspective. Um, it's super fun to do. You just have to kind of get used to it. Um, but overall, I think these drones are awesome. They're super fun to play with. Um, they're really easy to charge, put together, pair. Um, overall, the convenience package is there. So hopefully this video was helpful and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.